Hey guys, what's up? This is the reviewer 217, and today I'm going to be doing kind of a throwback review, I guess you can say. This is going to be on the Transformers Hunt for the Decepticons Deluxe Class Tomahawk. Now, um, here he is, and I'm not really quite positive what, um, vehicle this is. I really do not, and not good with naming vehicles off the top of my head. But, he is very cool, though. I do really like how this looks. Um, he does have missiles that go in right here, but I don't know where they are. I don't really care about finding them. But here he is, and oh, they are spring loaded though, so that's cool. Here he is, and yeah, just very cool. He's got a cool little cockpit in there. Really like that. The block is very nice. This is like the first ever um, flying Autobot that I ever got. And I still don't think I have one. I have a lot of Decepticons, but not too many Autobots. But first size comparison, here he is, and here he is with Decepticon Mind Weep. And Mind Weep is a Voyager, so. But there you go. It's quite bigger. But I think it is a little bit wider, though. I don't know. But yeah, very cool. And he does have a lot of. He's got these little turrets right here. Little guns, turrets. He's got some of these cannon things, which actually can deploy. Or you can take them off. And then he, he's got two missiles. But yeah, just very cool looking. Oh, and he's got cool little detail right here. So yeah, very cool. I really do like it. But now let's get this guy into robot mode and see. And let's take a look at him there. Okay, so what you're going to do is that you're going to disconnect these very easily. Get to disconnect them up there. Or actually, let's bring, okay, bring this down. Bring the feet down like so. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention he has landing gear. Oops. You bring these back to kind of form some heels, which is actually very cool. I do like that. Um, there you go. And you're going to bring these up. You're going to disconnect the arms. You're going to disconnect those. You're going to bring the arms out. Bring them down like that. And you're going to bring these up. Bring them up like that. There you go. And then, oh, you know what, actually? And then kind of bring these back like this. For the time being, then. Uh, I'll bring this down. Then you're going to bring this down. Got to pull the head out. Bring that up, and then you're gonna wanna. Oh, let me take these off real quick. Ah. Okay. Gotta fold that in like that. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Oh yeah, put them in. Bring these up like that. There you go. Ooh, this is tiring. <laughs> Having to bend over and stuff. Bring these back. And then there you've got him in robot mode. Okay, and right off the bat here are a couple size comparisons. Um, I don't know if it's because he's closer up to Optimus. Um, Optimus, he's about the same size as, J as the Ratchet. And a little bit smaller than the um, uh, Tomahawk. Which, that's a, um, he's actually, I think, a little bit smaller than the camera's making him off to look. But yeah, just right off some bats, the size comparisons. But here he is in his robot mode, and he is way awesome. This guy is way cool. Now, you can disconnect these, and I'll show you something. You can hold it like this in his hands. They don't stick too well, because it's kind of small little hint pegs. But I can hold them like that, which that's actually way cool. Or what you can do, 
I never knew what these were for, but I do now. You can pull these out like that. Pull them out. And you can actually connect them right here. Oh, whoops. You can connect them and kind of, I don't know, bring them down or whatever. Uh, can't really, kind of weird. But very cool. Now, one thing I really do like about this guy is that you can actually pull these down and kind of make some swords. And, yeah, and here you've got some really cool weapons. I do like how you can use those as mini swords. I think, yeah, you know, I just think that is way cool. I mean, just look at that. That is way awesome. And this guy just looks plain cool. Oh, quick little close-up of the head. I hope you can see that. It's kind of a little bit animated looking. I don't know. Wait. One second. No, oh, no, no. You can't see it at all. There he is. Yeah, very cool head look. I do like that head. Okay, now, if you can still find... Final thoughts. If you can still find this guy somewhere, do it. If you see him and you don't have him, get him. If you see him on a good price on eBay or something, get him. Because this guy is way awesome. This is a great collection to add to your um, Autobots that can fly or whatever. But totally recommend him. He, this, oh, this guy is way awesome. I love this guy. He just has a lot of cool stuff about him. But anyway, guys, um, that is my video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Make sure to subscribe. And I will see you later. Bye.